All right, let's get it. We finally here. The first episode of Let's Talk Detroit with the Detroit Discussion. I got one of the most talented up and coming artists in the game here with me today. For the ones who might not be familiar, tell the people who you are, where you from. I'm SBR Peasy. I'm from Detroit, Michigan, man. Peasy, my boy. Welcome to the show. Well, How you I doing, though, you bro? I appreciate you for having me, man. I'm doing good, man. Just grinding. All right, that's good, man. Let's get into your personal background. You from Detroit, Michigan. What part of Detroit are you from exactly? I was born on the east, raised on the west in Braymo in the Braymo area. Right. Okay. Okay. What was your childhood like growing up in that area? Man, my childhood. <clears throat> at the time, I was in music. I was. I wasn't really thinking about music. My brothers and sister was rapping, so music was around. But I was hooping, man. Hanging around the hood with my friends, bro. <clears throat> I was transferring a lot. I went to a couple schools over there, but. Hang around the food, the food with my friends, man. Get into shit, man, that we wasn't supposed to. Right, okay. Were both your parents in the picture? Yeah, both of my parents. They wasn't together, but they was in the picture. Okay, what did they do for a living? Uh, at the time, my mom was working at the factory. My pops was, too. Mm -hmm. How many siblings did you have? I got seven siblings. Seven? Yeah, I got seven of them. Five girls. Many... Five I, <clears throat> I, got, I got seven siblings. I got five girls and two brothers. One of my brothers passed. Damn, yeah, man. my brother passed when I was nine years old. Yeah, sorry to hear that. That's yeah, still a lot of kids, shit. though, man. Yeah, I swear. I know you were of... never bored, for real. Man, what? I was getting messed with all day. All yeah, I day. got four brothers and a sister. So, yeah, I kind of get it, for sure, for sure. Mm -hmm. So, what kind of, you know, what what schools did you attend growing up? Uh, I attended Gumpers. I attended VTOL on the west side. A couple of schools. What else? Uh... Uh, Aisha Shulay, people don't. Some people ain't even know about that. I got <clears throat> one year I had to transfer. I was on special. I got suspended. My mom was trying to like change everything. Like everybody I was around, my heart, whole circle. Aisha Shulay, that's on the West too. But it's a, it was an African school, bro. I was getting out of school at four thirty five, bro. <laughs> for real, for real. Mm, yeah. that. People don't <laughs> okay. even know about that, man. And still getting up at the same time I was regularly seven o'clock, six o'clock to four thirty five, bro. But it was an African school. She was like. She was just tired. She seen me hanging around the wrong people, and she was just trying to change that. I guess one of my cousins, you feel me, my cousins, you feel me, that's really their religion and shit, so. <clears throat> uh, they was over there, and they was telling my mom about it, and she was like, all right, I'm about to put you in this school. I came to the school. It wasn't no gym. Our right, gym was us beating on the drums and shit, so. <laughs> for real, so, yeah. So, like, do you think it did something for you? Like, did it change your behavior, or? Like yeah, de definitely. It just, it, I was viewing stuff different. Everything. It's just like, so I was born on the east. I probably moved west when I was like five or six. Then I was over there to, to like my junior year of high school, sophomore year of high school. So I went, I went to my high school. I went to Cody first, the MCH. Uh, then I transferred out to the birds on 18 and a half. So like, Damn. it was like, I, I was moving around so much, but. That shit helped me so much. Like, I done seen all type of people. I seen the people who just want to be on that rowdy shit. I seen the people who just want to go get some money. I seen some people who want to go get their education and degrees and so many different shit. And that just showed me how I can be in the room with anybody, like any personality. That shit right. helped so much. You feel me? Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, for sure. That's one thing that uh, a lot of people don't get, even my age, you know. I'm 27. You say you're 22, right? Yeah, I'm 22. Yeah, so even people my age, you know, people even older than us, you know, they don't really get it. They ain't really experienced nothing. A lot of us, you know, we still ain't got our passport, ain't been out the country. No. A lot of us ain't never, you know, people yeah. still think the east and the west side so much yeah, far apart. Facts. Yeah, so, yeah, I get it for sure, but that's yeah. good. You know, mom dude's looking out for you. Oh, yeah, definitely, always. Yeah.